Hey, what's up, guys? Darian here, and welcome back to Infinite Flight. As you can see, I'm flying a different plane again. Well, this lag, though. Anyway, let's get to the camera. There's my plane right there. Today I'm flying. Oh, hang on. I honestly don't even remember what this plane's called. I think it was like Cessna 308 or 208. Something with the 08. But yeah, so that's what I'm flying today. Today we're going to be flying from San Diego to um, San Clemente. Essentially, so... I've actually never flown this plane fully. I flew it once and I crashed because I was an idiot. But today I'm going to try to um, actually fly it and land it properly. I have no idea what the takeoff speed for this thing is, so I'm going to assume it's that I can take off now. It's a bit of a shaky takeoff, but sure. Uh, gear is always down. I was not pulling back enough. Okay, so, um, don't know how fast I should keep it going, so I'm going to keep the autopilot in control of the speed. Of course, it's, there's a wind pushing me back to a great. Um, this is a small propeller plane, so I know it's not going to be going high, so I'm going to put it at that much of a climb, and I'm going to have it climb to about... 3,000 feet. It's like a little bee. I hate bees, but still. This plane would probably be very fun to fly if you know how to fly it. However, you have to remember, I don't. Oops, uh, what heading should I be at? <laughs> Whoa! Turns quickly. Yeah, I'm way... Well, not way off, but I'm off. My heading slightly. So we're going to keep it at that until I intercept my, um... Course, and then I'll be good. Let's take a quick look around here. Okay, I got seats. San Diego Tower, November 605 Kilo India is 10 nautical miles to hmm. the east and 2100. This actually looks like a plane that um if I if you have your private pilot's license, you can actually probably fly this plane, I think. It's super number 1. I think it's small enough for that. At least I think, I'm not sure. Royal Abu Dhabi heavy. Hey, if that's the case, this would be a nice plane. Ground. Please expedite traffic on final. Uh, let's see if we can change our frequency here. Runway change? No. Frequency Delta change. Hotel Lima 125, yes, I'm change. flying as DHL125 this time because KLM is not available in this plane. And because I, I like how this plane looks in yellow. I don't know why, I just like it. Great. Thank you, bye-bye. Guarantee there's like no other frequency. Yep, yeah, of course. See, I should check this before I do anything stupid like that. But too late. How fast can I get this thing to go? Let us see, let us see. Infinite Flight 70 Heavy, hold short of runway 27. San Diego Tower, Air Canada 926. Okay, 170 minutes after that overspeed. So we'll keep it at 160 just for speed. Just for that. Anyway, um, 4 minutes 30 seconds in. Gonna use this little opportunity to, of me not doing shit. <coughs> just readjust my position on the bed. Yeah, use this opportunity of me not doing anything to talk to you guys. Oh, wow, look at that visibility, though. <sighs> Tired. Anyway, now, um, in a vlog I uploaded yesterday, I said why I haven't been uploading much, but I'm going to reiterate it here. 
I am not uploading too much anymore because now I have work experience to contend with, as well as school work, and my graduation transitions are also kind of messing with me, so my schedule is not the same as it usually is. I'm trying to get content out to you guys, but, you know, it's kind of hard to juggle this. That's why I'm, I'm able to upload so much now, it's the weekend, I have nothing to do, I'm not working, I have no homework. Yeah, I have no homework. I had to think about that. I was like, wait a minute, do I? Nah, I'm good. And the only thing I have to really finish is the graduation transitions booklet, and I'm going to finish that probably sometime later today. Well, how, cl how close are we to where we're going? Okay, not close at all. So yeah, I'm going to pause the recording here, and I will get back to you guys once I'm near San Clemente. See you guys in a second. Okay, I'm back. So, yeah, look at how bumpy this ride is. Here, look, just... All the turbulence is happening right now. Anyway, um, I just realized something. I don't... Oops, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. There we go. I don't know the speeds that I need to be hitting for this thing. Oh my god. 20 knot wind. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know the speeds I need to be hitting. So... This might end... Who knows how this will end. This could end in a crash. This could end well. Who knows. I just know I'm higher than everyone, so I'm not following a slope at all. So let's get it into a descent. This plane has no spoilers, so I'm going to have to hope it slows down when I tell it to. I'm um, sure. Flaps. I assume I can come in at 90 knots. That's my assumption, and I've got a feeling it's completely wrong, and I'm going to stall, and I'm going to crash. But we will see. So I'm going to lower to 110. Number four, behind the traffic on final, Air France 10. Making a right 360, Brickyard 909. Virgin 800. Okay, he actually did something about the other airplane that was right on my tail. Good. Too bad I can't do anything about the weather. The wind. Whoa! Making a right 360, Virgin 812. San Clemente Tower, Cebu 2111, ready for takeoff at runway 24, remaining in the pattern. Okay, and down to 90. We're going to put the flaps out fully, and then I'm going to fly it from here. Gear is already down, good. I am not sure how this thing breaks. I'm going to leave the brakes off when I touch down and see how it does, and if I need to, I'll put them on. Okay, but I am on final, so... Final two four. San Clemente Unicom Delta Hotel Lima one two five is on final runway two four. This is just terrible. Whoop! Oh, I meant to go to two three seven. Let's try two three eight. Maybe that'll be fine. Two three seven. Two three eight's perfect. I think I'm coming in a bit low, so. Uh oh, I'm way too low. One Alpha is taking off runway two four, remaining in the pattern. This is not going well. Okay, no, I'm gonna go around. San Clemente Unicom, Delta Hotel Lima one two five going around.
San Clemente Unicom, Uniform 882 is 3 nautical miles to the east at 700 feet, inbound for landing, will make straight and for run. I have like no idea where I'm going right now though, so. I just need to get myself up to 1500 feet. San Clemente That's Unicom, gonna be my safe Solaris altitude. 914 is on final, runway uh -oh. 24. San Clemente Unicom, 1 Alpha, going around. No. I have like no altitude to recover from this. So I'm trying to hold the nose at a certain. San Clemente Unicom, one alpha is I'm trying to hold the nose like the down here but it's not letting me because it's going to start it landing, starts to turn right and then I have to try to, to pull back to correct it so it doesn't Unicom, descend. Solaris 914 is on final runway 24. So I kind of get screwed. I'm only at 600 feet. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. No, you don't, plane. Okay, I think I'm going to try and come in from runway 6. God damn it, I keep doing that. Okay, I'm going to try to come in from 6. Because I don't think I can make a full go around. So let's see if the plane can make it. Hopefully it can. 900 feet I need to descend. San Clemente Unicom, Air France 10 is on final, runway 24. Oh damn, that's the runway. I am not far forward. Fine, I'm going to make a sort of S approach then. Because that might be quick, quicker than the other way. San Clemente Unicom, Delta Charlie Heavy is on final, runway 24. This is a turbulent approach. See, I'm trying to keep the nose level, but... The wind keeps pushing it up. Oh wow, it's already at 1500. And it's banking again and it's lagging, so I don't know what the hell's happening. Where's the runway? What the hell? Oh, I'm turning into it. Oh, shit. Now you don't. Okay, there's the runway. No, I'm not, re not reporting position yet. Okay, I'm going to do it from here. If I can do it tower, can I see better? No, that's not going to help me. It's going to probably hinder me in the long run. Start our bank. Let's see if the little um plane can make it. The little plane that could. Oh wow, I'm going a little fast there, so reduce power. Report that I'm on final. Runway two four again. Delta Hotel Lima 125 is on final, runway 24. This is actually going to be fairly difficult, because now I'm going way too fast, because I've put myself too high. Come on, the little plane that could. I'm getting a speed violation now, great. Oh, I should have reduced power before I started the descent, my bad. I'll take the violation, it was my fault. Okay, I've announced on final, I'm good on that. Let's see if we can do it. If we can do it this time. Two I'm gonna have the autopilot control the heading right Unicom. now though. Solaris right there. Two, three, nine. Off runway two four, remaining in the pattern. Don't take off. San Clemente Unicom, Delta Charlie Heavy, going around. Okay. San Clemente Unicom, Delta Hotel Lima two five is on final, runway two four. 
San Clemente Unicom, November 405 Uniform Romeo is 19 nautical miles to the east at 5,800 feet. Inbound Coming in. Landing. We'll make straight in for runway yes. 24. Not yet, not yet. Oop. It bounced. It's bouncing. You know, I think, well then. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Bye-bye. Yeah, I think I'm going to count this as a crash, because quite honestly, I'm at 100%. It's not moving, and th the wheels are just morphed into the ground. So yeah, um, I'm going to try again with this um, landing in a different video, I think. So if you like the video, leave a like and a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new, and if you want to get notified about our videos, then click the little bell icon, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.